Okay, y'all. Spiritually savage here again. I had to readjust my bun. It came down and it's too hot, but to hang down. But I made it. I made it to the top of the mountain. It's 11.38, so I started at 11.20. That's 18 minutes to get up. But I stopped and came and stopped and came and stopped and came. I didn't stop longer than the 60 seconds. But I had to stop at least five times, y'all. It's not even because I'm tired. My legs was hurting. Like my thighs feel like jello climbing up this mile, which means I know I need to strengthen them. So I'm holding myself accountable to walk this mountain. As long as God provide me with gas, cause y'all know my situation. And right now I'm sitting on the full tank. Uh, I'm gonna come up at least five times a week. Cause my goal is by the end of October to be able to run up the mountain. And if I stay consistent, I know I can do it. Cause right now, at the gym that I normally attend, it's squat toba. So that means they doing squats all day, every day. So the closest thing, cause I, I can't, I can't, I can't, I don't like to say I can't, but I am not motivated to do squats by myself. Cause the moment I feel that burn, I stop. But the thing about this mountain is, you want to make it to the top now. You want to make it to the top. So, you can stop halfway, but you know you still got more to go. And that's going to push my legs. So, I got to figure out a way to Jedi mind trick myself into doing leg work. Because sitting in the house, it just ain't going to cut it for me unless I got a trainer. And that's been my whole life. This ain't nothing new. I can't, I'm not a, I'm not a self-starter when it comes to working out. I can run, I can walk, but when it comes to strength training, that's not my forte. I need assistance for that part. But this mountain will be my assistance. It's gorgeous out here too though. So I'm gonna give myself a little break and then I'm gonna head on back down. I wanted to bring Lucky up here, but he was, I ain't heard him cry like that in a long time and he was just crying. This, it may be a time where he got to get in that backpack so we can go. I brought him up here one time, and he ain't do as much crying as he did when I put him in there to put him in the car. I'm talking about he was crying. I was like, what? Okay. And I don't want to torture my baby, so I left him at home. But I did tell him, maybe a time where we may have to make our grand escape, and you're going to have to get in that backpack, and I'll deal with the crying. But I don't want to cause my baby no undue stress if not necessary. So I'm about to head back down, y'all. I'm at the top. Beautiful view. It's gorgeous. Like-minded souls up here too, getting our morning Saturday workout on. It's a group over there. They look at them. I love it. I love it. All right, my loves. Till next time, do something to, in, to inspire yourself. Do something to strengthen your body, strengthen your mind. This, 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 this mountain will have you conquering your mind, your body, and your spirit. Cause your spirit gonna try and keep, gonna keep you going. You're gonna have to go against your mind, cause your mind gonna want you to tell you stop. Even your body gonna go against you when them legs feel like jello. My legs feel like jello, and it's just the thighs part. My thighs, so I will be coming back up here. It's a great meditation space, too. Can't meditate with all this noise, though. I mean, I know some can, but I'm not trained to that extent yet, so I barely can control the voices in the house I'm in, but meditate with them going on. All right, my loves. See, I'm down in the mountain. Let's see how long it takes me to get down. I'm going to record my time this time. Because, you know, when you go down, it don't be much. So, it's 11.43. Now, I'm going to go at 11.44. This enough. I am love this breeze. And as I said that, it was 4.44. When I said this enough and looked at the time, it was 4.44 on the clock. So, 11.44 is a good time to go. I may got 30 seconds left, y'all. Let's see. 
I'm gonna let y'all see when I go down. It's always quicker when you go down because you got momentum on your side. Thank you, God. It's 11:44. Let's get it. Okay. All right, my loves. I'm heading back down, heading home. Take a shower. Make me a breakfast quesadilla. Nope, not a burrito. A breakfast quesadilla. <laughs> I love you guys. I love you so much. I shall see and talk to you guys soon. Namaste. Ashe. Mazel tov. Spiritually Savage, signing out on Savage Saturdays. Hola.